Amen Rao, the chairman of the state's local government advisory committee and former speaker of Tarapa State, Honorable Abel Peter Dia, says teachers, health workers, and traditional rulers' salaries will be recommended on first line charge to Governor Agbu Kefas. He said these during a stakeholders' meeting in Jalingo. A correspondent, Jude Nuhu Gundali, filed in this report. The local government advisory committee in Taraba State is holding this meeting with representatives from the Nigerian Union of Local Government Employees, Norge, and leaders of the primary school teachers and primary health workers' unions. The purpose is to discuss how local government autonomy could be effectively implemented in the state. During the meeting, the union leaders shared the challenges they face and provided suggestions on the way forward. For effective local government system in Taraba State, Norge and Medical and Health Worker Union chapter of the state, therefore, have the following recommendation to Advisory Committee on Local Government Authority. Award review of payment made to Local Government Service Commission and uh, Primary Health Care Agency. Review of gratitude and pension template. The current template used for calculating gratitude, gratuity, and pension should be reviewed upward. Autonomy is a good idea and it's a welcome idea. We support the autonomy. But our fear as teachers is that what happened in the past will not happen again. Because we have a situation, we had a situation whereby teachers were not paid for more than a year. As up to now, teachers are still owing four months salaries. So we demand that the NPEC be established. That is the National Primary Education Commission. Or alternatively, the First charge should be directed to survey for onward payment of teachers. The chairman of the committee, Abel Peter Deer, assured that all their demands are part of the first line charges to be recommended to the governor. Our implementation is going to be part of the amendments we we'll make in our laws that will make it very difficult for any council to commence any other payment without your salary being paid first. So it's the same like the first line charge. He, however, called for cooperation between all critical stakeholders to work towards the success of the local government autonomy granted by the Supreme Court for the development of the state. To the union leaders and key stakeholders, your role in this process is crucial. You are the voices of the people, the champion of progress, and the guidance of our collective aspiration. We must come to, together in the spirit of unity and collaboration to fully understand the implication of this historic judgment and to chart a way forward that truly benefits the people of Taraba State. Governor Abu Kefis has demonstrated his administration's readiness to comply with the Supreme Court's judgment by allowing the elected local government chairman across the state's 16 local governments to assume their constitutional responsibilities. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.